Gertha! She wishes to make your acquaintance! Athenus! You'll be in the duat soon! Prepare yourself! Come, Jugatha! Charge! The gods have entrusted me with your demise! in our great plan. Oh, how I wish you could see yourself from such an angle. Your role in that insane order comes to an end, Potinus. Face your judgment. They went too far in Siwa. I knew it then. But I just wanted peace for Egypt. Your peace leaves many wanting. This is inevitable. A good rule always does. My apologies, Bayek of Siwa. My fee is covered, it seems. Now may I go to my glory. There is no glory left in Egypt. The damned eunuch is no more. Good. The speculatores found Septimius. He is in the village beyond. I will distract his men while you capture him. We must know what he plans. You would think your spies would already know. They have their limits. But they claim Aya has the scent of that puppet king. So they also have their uses. Then Ptolemy is already caught. I will finish the rest. Fool finally comes. You will see your god soon. Ah! Bayek of Siwa, we finally fight. Are you ready for your end? Prepare to face judgment, Septimius. You will find yourself in the door soon. Is that all your fury, Menchai? No wonder it was so easy to take your country. Yeah, keep talking, dog! You will find my fury soon! Cease your baseless attempts to fight!
Did you miss me? Stop, Bayek! Septimius is Roman. We will deal with him under our laws. He killed my son! Everything for which we have worked for so long is now ours. We have defeated our enemies. Only I can lead Egypt into a new era of prosperity. So you stand with Septimius now, and we are banned from the palace. No, I do not begrudge the venom in your eyes, but listen for a moment. Speak quickly, or you will find yourself at the wrong end of my blade. Your services are no longer needed. Cleopatra has granted you gold. I am sorry, Aya. Sorry? We gave her everything. We gave her that damn crown, and she stands next to him. And where is justice for us? Septimius was supposed to be judged by Rome. Is Caesar protecting the order? There are compromises to make a queen of Cleopatra. The man who killed our son is your ally. We are going to do whatever it takes to kill him. You realize? Look, 
Caesar blames you for the death of Ptolemy. A pharaoh, a god, Bayek, I cannot change this. Be damned what Caesar thinks. It is with Cleopatra that I made the pact. Give me time, Aya. I will ease this for us. Until then, I beg you, be careful. Not everything is as it seems. Ah! Traitor. With all my words, I have nothing to say now. Cleopatra has been poisoned by Rome, and we by her treachery. We will burn with Egypt. The order is stronger now. They have Rome. I will deal with this. Hold on, hold on. I was wrong. I am responsible. When my boy died, I fought back with rage and anger. But this only made them stronger. We are all different. But we fought together to put Cleopatra on the throne. Now this was a mistake, my friends. But at least it brought us together. Now our enemies are hidden behind crowns. Walking in the shadows of kings and queens. Who are the ones that walk in the shadows for the people? We are. Something has come of all of this. And it starts right now. We must continue the fight and defend the free will of the people. And no matter how small, our brotherhood is the only hope. And our kingdom needs no crowns. What we believe in, our values, our creed, will unify us. And I promise that for all the songs of Egypt, I will be the father I was not that day in Siwa. To the Brotherhood. The Brotherhood! You were right. I trusted the wrong goddess. There's a question that yet lingers. Septimius. He took Alexander's stuff. Why? Indeed. He and Flavius had too much interest in Alexander's tomb. We start there. All done. 